Listen up. Everybody get up. Yes. I've been thinking a lot about today what I want to tell you. You know, I've told you a lot of things today as we've gone through the process of walk through and, and our film and all that stuff. I want to go back to March whenever Josh Thomas came and spoke to us. He said you got to be OCD to win it all. you got to be obsessed, but there's three things. You've seen it every single week on your highlight film. It's been talked about. You have an opportunity that not a lot of people get, and that's a second chance. You have an opportunity. Take advantage of that opportunity. we got to be consistent, and we got to be consistent at doing what we do. we got to be us. We can't be anybody else. we got to be us. Richard's got to be clapping. Old line's got to be getting off the football. The committee's got to be the committee. The whip's got to be the whip. And Lodge's got to be Lodge. Yeah. Do you understand what I'm saying? Yes, sir. The other thing is, you got to have the discipline that we went through boot camp, summer, in 19 weeks to get right back here. Oh, see. And then the last thing, and we ended it in the gym today. You got to be uncommon. You got to be an uncommon man today that. Your brothers mean more than you do. That sideline has got to be yelling and going crazy. I should right. see towels everywhere. If you're not on the field, you're yelling for your brothers. Right. you got to be uncommon. Because if you think about yourself, you're going to miss the opportunity. It ain't about me. It ain't about you. It's about us. Right. It's about us. Right. That's what it is. It's about us. We gotta care about us. We gotta love each other. Go, child. Here we go. Touch a horn of our heads. Heavenly Father, we thank you so much for this great and awesome day, God. Lord, 19 weeks ago, Father God, you assembled a group of upcoming men. You gave us a common purpose, Father God, a common mission. That you had anointed these coaches, Father God, with vision and with tenacity to lead these young men to the mountaintop. God, you delivered us to the mountaintop as you promised that you would. And just as you've done every week, Father God, we ask that you would go before us and lead us into battle. Father God, when, when Moses went before Pharaoh and he demanded that the children of Israel be released, the Bible says he released the seventh plague, which was hail. And the Bible says that it descended upon the Egyptians so severe they had never seen anything like it yes. since the Egyptians had been a nation. So, Father God, we're releasing a hailstorm tonight. It's going to be a perfect storm. And just as God told Moses, I'm telling you tonight, men, don't be afraid. Stand firm and see the salvation of the Lord. And the Katie that you see tonight, you will see no more. God, as you've done every week, Father God, we believe that you protected this family. We ask that you do it one more time, Father God. Protect this family with a long one victory. And we'll be so careful to give you all the praise, all the glory, and all the honor. It's in the mighty name of Jesus that we pray. Amen. 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 Let's go.